In this video, we'll show you how to use the visual editor of cards and what features are in this WordPress plugin. We've entered the WordPress dashboard and opened the visual editor of cards. Let's start to build our web page. Open the left panel and choose the desired block. Click it and the block will appear in the visual editor. Change the image using drag and drop directly from your computer. Change the text of this block. Choose the layout and position of changed text. Change the background color. In our case, we'll remove the color. Next, let's change the font. Select the text and choose the font from the list. Change the size of the text, and that's all. Continue to build the page by choosing other blocks from the left panel. We need to write some text, so we'll choose the text block and click it. Now I want to change the padding between blocks. Click the blue delimitator and drag it down or up to change the distance. Now, click the text block and change appearance. I want to change padding. Here's another option on how to change the padding. Let's change the background of text block. Click the icon and click appearance. Choose background, and here we'll change the color. You can use the color picker to select the desired color. We'll change the text in the same way like before. Choose the font and size and color. Copy the custom text here. For the next website section, we'll choose a block from the grid, change the layout, and deactivate a few block elements. Change the padding and the size of the text. You can see the text changes automatically in the entire grid, not only in the edited element, a feature that will save you a lot of time. Now we need an image block. Choose it and change the image position using the visual editor. Drag and drop images from your computer and change the background color using appearance as in the previous step. And change padding between blocks. Okay, for the next section, choose the text block and copy and paste the new text here. Change the font and size. Now let's change the background color to be the same color as the block above. Add a new block from the left panel. We'll use this block for a video presentation. Select the YouTube video ID and paste it here. Click autoplay and the video is ready. Change the color and font of the text from this block using Visual Editor. Copy and paste the new text and change the background color of this block. Now choose the other block. Drag and drop here the new image. We need one more block for an icon, so click the desired block and drag the new image icon here. Change the padding and add one more block. Change the padding and deactivate unused elements. Then we can change the font of the text. We continue to build our page by choosing one more image block in the same manner as the previous step. You can duplicate this block and change the image icon. Also, we need one more block like before. Duplicate it and change the text. Now that you can see the whole page, it has a really nice look to it. Let's continue to build. Choose a new block. Drop in the new image. Duplicate the previous blocks. Drag and drop the new image icon. Paste the new text. And activate the new block elements. Just drag and drop the new images as desired. Choose the new block. 
change the image in the same way like before, and we have a really big image, and it looks good. Continue with new blocks. Changing padding, images, and the text. If you need a block type that you've used before, choose the block and duplicate it. Now we'll show you our code editor, where you can edit the CSS and HTML. Just remember that if you change the HTML, you can't use the visual editor for this block. But don't worry, you can reset the menu later and start to use the visual editor again. Now, we'll paste the new code to show you how it works and save. This page will be a story page, and it will be long. Let's add one more block. Drag and drop the new image and change the text. Let's make some CSS changes by clicking Custom CSS and pasting or writing the code. Click Save, and then let's take a look at your work. I think we need one more block, so let's duplicate this block and change the text. Add one more block. Change the image in the same way. The entire page is ready and you can publish it.